And at Columbus Grove, home of many state track and field champions, will begin in the field in the shot put. Grove's Reese Roney, 45 feet, 5 inches. He would finish in second place. As no one was topping Josh Miller from Botkins. His best putt was 47 feet, 3 inches on the day. Move to the pole vault pit. Columbus Grove with a pair in the final four. Hayden Grothaus clears 12 feet here. Teammate Kyle Schaefer also vaulting over 12 feet. But the top seeded vaulter in the state is Anna's sophomore Logan Kantz. Breaks the school record here, clearing 15 feet 2 inches. Go to the long jump pit now. Ada's Carly Marshall jumping 15 feet. She would finish in third place behind Audeville's Alicia Honigford. And then Honigford in the finals of the 100 hurdles finishes second behind Grove freshman Carly McClure. 16.2 seconds. Boys 110 high hurdles, and it's Anna's Grant Glover in 15.67 seconds. Bakken's Micah Smock in second. PG's Matthew Bruce making it, or er, uh, Anna's Matthew Bruce making it a Shelby County sweep in third place. As we look at the final results from Columbus Grove, the Lady Bulldogs take first place with Bakken's finishing in a second. Riverdale Anna Ottaville round out your top five for the boys. It's Anna in first with Columbus Grove in second, followed by Riverdale Botkins and Delphus Jefferson.